Everybody grab one and let's study it. Oh, perfect. I might sit here for a while. There's some over there too. This is called purple dead nettle and it has a very ominous name. It's actually not poisonous at all. This is a wild mint. It doesn't smell like mint. So we're engaging all our senses. Everybody smell it. Kind of has like a musky smell. The reason it's called purple dead nettle is because it kind of looks similar to stinging nettles. And because of that, people don't like the way that nettles itches. I think I guess that's where it got the name. All mints have a square stem. So just like the dandelion has a smooth stem, all mints have a square stem. The mint family is full of edible plants. It's a good thing to know. How would you use this? I would just basically take that much of it and throw it in anything. Whether that, that is a, a salad, this, you know, it's a little bit fuzzy, so I probably wouldn't eat this raw, but um, I mean, I, I could eat it raw, but because it's a little bit fuzzy, I wouldn't enjoy it as much. So let's come up with some ways that you would eat this. Anybody? Saute. I like the tea idea, but I mean, let's, let's get creative here. What else could you do with this? Don't worry, if you, if you say something I don't like, I'll tell you. Pizza? Anybody else? Tempura. Tempura, yeah, I like it. Those are all great. Can you eat the stem? You can eat the stem. And all mints, again, help to calm the system. So if you have any sort of seasonal allergies or um, you ate something and it, it doesn't agree with your belly, eating a little bit of mint will help to soothe it. So that's a really good thing to know. So maybe if you're going traveling internationally, if you want to go above and beyond, you take some purple dead nettle and you dry the leaves and you mix it with some blackberries or raspberries and you dry the leaves and you kind of make yourself a little bag of, of greens, which hopefully <laughs> customs won't <laughs> sniff you for. I usually put it in like a little supplement bottle. I think that's what supplements are good. They have like a nice little thing and, and then I just make a tea out of them abroad.